So let's go get the one bug in Castletown. We have to go all the way here for one bug, but, you know, I guess it's kind of important to get that one bug. Alright. Uh, I know where to go. I showed you on your map where to go. With the white dots. Just down here, and you'll see an alleyway, and there's one more alleyway after that one alleyway. There's a big alleyway and a small alleyway. There's this big alleyway. And we want the small alleyway. That leads over here. We don't want to go in there. We The bug is actually in these boxes over here. We don't even need to go into the place where we found Ilya, which is actually a bar, Toma's bar. Uh, it's, wow, that's a really big one. Are they getting bigger? They might be. Wouldn't be surprised, but... Oh. I found that that one looks a little bigger than some of the others. Okay, now, uh... See, the, we have a lot in Zora's domain, so... Let's warp there! And aren't you glad we have a warp point there? I sure am. Or else we would have to do a lot of running, and... Uh, would we even be able to get there with the bird? No, we wouldn't. So, we need the warp point to get there. Thank you, Shadow Beasts, for helping us without realizing you were helping us. So we have one up here in the top part of Zora's domain where all the Zoras like socialize or something. Uh, I think it's over here on the wall somewhere. Maybe it's just flying around. And then we have four um, down in the other area. I don't want to target the sleeping Zora. I don't want to target the evil flying bug. Okay. Okay, let's uh, swim down. And that's the last of the bugs. Maybe. Okay, we have two right here in the center. Now, if you notice, oh, you want to stay on the lily pads, by the way. Um, if you notice, uh, we have four bugs over here. And it looks like there's five more tiers of light, so there's one bug not accounted for. And why would that be? And that's the phone ringing in the other room. Why is one bug not accounted for? I will tell you when we have to deal with that problem. Um, where's that other tier? But actually, it was a really cool idea that they did to sort of make the last tier of light more epic than all the others. And if only we could use the spirits of the Zoras as Tears of Light, because they kind of look like them. Uh, that green stuff, that's like ice. Um, we will be going in that place when that ice melts some other time. Why did I jump off? Uh, we want to climb up here, because there's a tier here. And this is the harder of the two tiers on either side, and I'm just doing the harder one first, because I like to get the harder out of the way. Why not? If I could play the most frustrating part of this game first, I would love to. And I hope I don't fall off again. Ah, I almost fell off. Uh, I think you, there might be something up there. Probably not. Nope. Oh, why did I fall off? Oh, I do remember that. Still, even though you you don't maybe you don't really understand that. Even though I'm not playing, it still frustrates me a little bit. Oh, it's the wrong way. Even though, I, even when I know it's going to happen, it always, oh, seeing it happen always frustrates me. Because I know that's me playing. That's me who did that. And yes, this is me playing. I did not copy this game footage from a walkthrough site. Again, the fake Let's Player who copies his gameplay footage from a walkthrough site and audios over pretending it's live commentary when it's not and writes a script. Uh, not very good Let's Players do that. I don't know anyone who does that. I don't, think, I don't know, even know if anyone does, but... Uh, you could probably fool a lot of people that way. Write your scripts. <laughs> Make up funny stuff. Pretend you just thought of it on the spot. 
the best Let's Players can think of things to talk about on the spot. I never usually think about to think of things to talk about. I usually just talk about whatever's going on in the video. And even if there's nothing going on in the video. Uh, yeah. And this is the kind of time I would talk about how you want to follow the trail of green rupees. And the horror of the two bugs is over here. And it's flying around. And they seem to all be flying around. So there's nothing very special about that. Okay, now let's go get a, the last simple tier. Really easy tier. Of course, we have two left. Last one, not so simple, but this one's pretty simple. Uh, those two rocks will be important later that we just passed. Uh, the bug is not in the water, and I'm pretty sure I'm going the wrong way. Uh, yeah. Those two rocks right there, pretty important later. They are mentioned. Not so important as the rocks are, but just what's near them is important later. And there is a golden bug right around here, but we can't get it when it's twilighty. Again, I said, said twilighty again. <laughs> uh, I thought the bug was here for a second, but then I realized it's not. We want to run up the cliff first. Zora's got a nice place to live. Uh, oh, wait, no. Not bug here. It's a... There's no bug here. It's a chest. Let's get the chest. I think it's only a ten rupee, but I wouldn't be surprised because it is a small chest. Hopefully it'll be more. Yep, ten. You can get that for defeating some enemies. What's so great? Why does that need to be in a chest? Why do they put ten rupees in chests? You can get ten rupees really easily not in chests. Uh, where is the bug then? Oh, it's under the ground. That's the one, the last one, not the second one, the one that was under the ground. Okay, I knew one of them at least was. There's always at least one per area that's under the ground. Alright, and that's the eleventh tier, and now Minda wants to talk to us. Hey, what's going on? There should be one more tier. Where could the last tier be? That's strange. Oh, wait, I think I see it. What? There it is. How did we miss it before? This is so weird. Yeah, I'll say it is pretty weird, but really cool. So let's now use our warping to go to Lake Hylia now that we can. We got Shadow Beasts made a warp point for us, and let's go see what is up. Why is the tier over there when it didn't show up before? Oh, what's that? It kind of looks like the red sparks that come off the bugs, but it's a lot bigger. Ooh, and there's ominous lightning. You know things are about to get cool when they do ominous, unneeded lightning that probably wouldn't happy, happy, happen in real life. Of course, none of this would happen in real life. Maybe. Maybe. Let's go see what's up with this last tier.